What's up, Reapers? Welcome to Alex Poor Corals. This is Alex Wilson, your host, and this is my daily video log of my reefing experiences to hopefully give you the daily details needed to learn from my mistakes. So let's check out what I got here today. And here's a shot of the main display today. And definitely have a little bit more of the brown algae going, or the greens. Definitely have the greens taken off on the back glass and on the rock. Definitely have a little bit more of the photosynthesis, some oxygen bubbles coming off of the rocks. But no problems there. So corals are looking pretty good. No complaints so far today. Everything's looking pretty good after that uh, chemical clean treatment and everything. So fingers crossed there, everything's going to be doing okay. Here's a shot of my recordia. Mushrooms up here got a yellow tang. We trying to get pictures of the recordia is here. Oh, I got yellow tang over here. But the green, green and yellow tang. But I already just, I just fed you anyway. I just gave him some nori and some flake should be good mysis pe mysis shrimp flake so should be good on the flakes on the food anyway we'll look at the blastomusa right here and other than that we could get a quick top down shot of what we're looking at here so blastomusa and some of my Goniastrius right there. This one is a little bit different. Brownish, reddish color on them. Got that one from Unique Corals. Can't remember the exact name, but it's definitely a Goniastria. And you got the clams over here. Gold Max, Ball Blue Maxima, Squamosa, and the other Golden Maxima. And Christmas tree warm rock with varieties on one side, Coraline algae on the other side. Okay, so I guess that's about it. I guess too much, too much current over here on turbulence on the right hand side for a top down shot. But go always check it out from the front. Got the Duncan right there going crazy. Likes that spot right there, right there a little bit less flow. And let's add that one, just one polyp. Now nah, it's all kinds of polyps. Looking pretty good. Check out the green slimer. Yep, there it is. Good polyp extension, good color, still alive. Gotta love it. Hopefully it's gonna take off. Put them over here in the middle of the aquarium. Here's the size of Posse Lopora. Good polyp extension, good color. Same thing there. So hopefully it'll grow little by little. And everything else over here is just that meat coral bubbles. Get a shot. Side shot. Little cloudy. Little bit of this crazy greens over here. Getting a lot of bubbles. And maybe a little bit of red on there too, some kind of a little bit of the red, I don't know, cyanobacteria or what on that back glass a little bit too. Oh well, yellow tanks liking it. This, check out the quarantine system. See how it's doing today. Here it is. 20 gallon quarantine. Got this uh, Aquamax protein skimmer hanging on the back thing Bob going. And uh, so, you know, I just put this one together kind of as a, uh, just a quick uh, idea you know, where I just had the stand left over here and I was, um, I had the two 10 gallons, so, but ideally this is, uh, you know, the absolute smallest that I could do. It's going to do it again, I would do it uh, probably just a little bigger, you know, having at least the, the depth that this one is, it's like 15 15 inches I believe and so this is a 20 but if I was to do it again I'd probably go with like a 
40 gallon guaranteed with the all-in-one ready to go in the back with the built-in or with the you know work with a protein skimmer you take it take the protein skimmer out easily replace it whereas this one is just one whole box so if the protein skimmer or the pump on it kind of goes I have to re replace the whole box there so I think I would prefer the all-in-one or, or with the sun for that matter but I was kind of thinking all the one and uh, yeah alright so let's, let's check out how everybody's doing here today and brown slime is gone thanks to the chemi clean treatment and I don't know if it was dinoflagellates, red slime, brown slime, whatever it is, it's gone. At least it right here. It's still down here in the sand, but it's still dissipating more and more. As you can see here, it got these like circles. That's where it's dying back, I believe. So I'm gonna keep an eye on that. But I've had it kind of used that as an indicator in the past. Whereas, you know, I would just kind of see it appear in the sand a little bit right here, and that's when I would go ahead and add the red slime remover. But going with uh, Kimmy Claim from now on, guaranteed. And uh, also heard on uh, Reef Bum over there with uh, Keith Burkelhammer, and he was talking about how quite a few people out there are using the Kimmy Claim certainly as uh, just kind of proactively. Uh, I'm not sure how. How often they actually uh, use it, whether it's uh, weekly or monthly or uh, or what, but yeah, so that's definitely uh, something that I might consider. And yeah, you got the check out the home record. Definitely has some really nice, really nice pulp extension on. I'm looking good on the color, everything. So awesome there. Rainbow splices. That's right, guys. I got two rainbow splices. I must have lost my mind. I probably should just went with just the one. Mad enough to lose just one rainbow splice, let alone two. But there they are. And everyone else looking pretty good about the same since my last video here. This is the radical red stag. Moved them up a little bit. And this is the fireworks. Acropore right there, nice color on them. And Oregon Tort, I think it might be dying. It's just sticking up, barely up right there from the whole die off right there. But there's a little bit on them, so I don't know if it's going to come back or not, but there it is. And definitely looking good is the Apes Key Lime Pie right here. Excellent pop extension, excellent color. Moved them up over here, so hopefully it's going to get a little bit more light. And the clown's freaking out on me. It's closing a little bit. Silophora and the orange digitata looking pretty good. Mushrooms are still closed in the back, but everything else. Christmas tree worms. Everything else looking pretty good. Cons considering and yep so that's it guys i guess it's a quick update but look for the next one do see the progress see what has died what has lived and uh so that's it happy reefing guys check out the next one bye